My sleep break the alarm sound. Let me introduce myself. I'm John Wyan. He is very cold and seems to look like rude and coldy and hate me too. I'm Orton. Because of his mom, we both had wet. I stand up from my bed and took my clothes for bath. I walked to washroom. As my mom opened the door, I walked to it but hit someone. You try to get to washroom, but you could try to get out from there. As I hit him, I lost my balance. Hey, can't you see me? As she hit with me, I hold her waist and say her from fail. I'm sorry, I didn't know that you was in washroom too. I almost skipped my heartbeat to see him there. I wear my clothes and then set my hair quickly. I walked out from room. After a few minutes, I was entering in my room with my coffee cup because I have to check some emails so I planned to took my coffee in my room but as I entered why it hit me this time my all coffee fell on me. My lucky shirt spoiled by that. What the hey you have ice or not? Are you walking you spoiling my lucky shirt? From morning you try to mess my life and finally your mission success. I look down and bite my lips. I hold my tears. He looks so much in anger. I didn't know that. I didn't have any bad intention for something like that. I always try to go closer to him, but nothing. Everything is just worse. He reminds the same angry person. As she started to cry, I sign. Again, your fake crying drama started. Don't you shame to cry like this and spoil my shirt? You are such a fool. As I heard his yell, I come in room there and looked at them. I quickly walked to and see him on anger. Hey, why are you mad in morning? What's the matter? I'm really sorry. I did my mistake. You sobbed in with your tears. You didn't dare to look up. Ask your daughter-in-law that what has happened here. Why? And now stop to cry and see that what you did again that he made at you. If your drama is over, then explain your mother-in-law that what you did. I shake my head. You both can't live peacefully. I told you that don't wed me with this fool, but you didn't hear me. I'm really sorry. By your sorry, my shirt not gonna find. You both fight for a little shirt. Cook, don't fight for this. Go and wear other shirt now. Mom, that was my lucky shirt and today important dealers are coming our home here. And what about my luck? We shouldn't believe on our we should believe on our hard work, not only on luck. I know that you're doing hard work too. Shut up. I don't need your any advice. You also shut up. She just dropped coffee on you, nothing else. It's just by for mistake. No, don't cry for a shirt. You are not little kid. I don't want to hear anything. Change your shirt and light up your mood, understand? But mom, you always take her side. She is my choice and now no more argument. Believe on yourself and get ready fast. And why and don't stand like here. Go and give him other shirt fast. Mrs. John is main lady of mansion. Without her permission, a single leaf can fail from tree. She grow cook who is very disciplined and cooks every important decision are taken by his mom always. Jake was in love with her university friend whose name was Lena. She was beautiful and very smart and cook love like Lena and her father was family friend too but cook's mom didn't like her as well. His mom met you at cafe he was doing part time job there and she Tests you in many ways and chose you for his son as his wife, but unfortunately he didn't feel for you. He didn't like you, and now he is hating you because he still like Lena. As my mom left room, I quickly locked room and then pinned her harshly. 
as he pinned me i shocked in fears i was so afraid of him my heart beat increased rapidly as he looked at me in anger too i only feel hit and anger in his eyes i avoid to look at him my mom like you that's not mean i gonna accept you if you think that with time i will accept you then you are such a fool cuz i'm never gonna accept you he said in a rude tone and then in a deep hate in his voice that you feel i hold my tears i wish that i could got a better life too i know that he never gonna accept me and sooner or later he only gonna leave me i know it i bite my lips and ro- tears rolling down from my eyes cry on your destiny I never gonna whip your are gonna trap in your fake tears also don't dare to show yourself in front of my guest cuz i not want that they meet you you are such a useless i sobbed after he heard that all words how can someone can be so rude he always just want to hurt me and insulting me i will not show myself to his guest that's it If you understand then now give me my other shot fast i'm getting laid i'm as free as you and do as i said or i can do anything with that word he passed now you can cry truly i hold my hand and with my tears i want to rise up and then took his other shot and then give him here is it mrs coiner i run this shot now and hurry up and don't dare to burn this shot or i will gonna make your skin stain like my shot i started to iron his shirt carefully after it i gave it and he wear it then he walk for his office meeting with his tailor i reached at office and soon as mr kim come I welcomed him and then started our meeting. Jamuk is most powerful businessman in such a young age too. His nature was bossy and rude too. I walked in kitchen. I was lost in my deep thought. As I entered in kitchen, I looked at Wayne and quickly asked the chef, "Wayne, again you doing daydreaming? What is in your mind? You burn this milk. You can do single work. Gosh." As she yelled at me, I come back to my sense and bow at her. I'm really sorry, mom. What I do now with your sorry? You know that cooks guests are coming, so you have to care for them and also greet them and now make snacks for them and welcome that. I nodded and started to cook snacks quickly, make fast, no mistake, and ready for punishment. I will not disappoint you, mom. Good then. After a while, you were still preparing food in kitchen. Doorbell rang. As doorbell rang, his mom went to welcome them. After welcome them, they sit on living room, and then you come again in kitchen. Mary take this all living room for guest. Yeah, they are his dealers, and you are his wife, and you should welcome them. And you see this to mad. go now by yourself and serve them but mom i know please i can't he said me to not show myself to his guests and then mom said me to show me to them where i'm stuck i glared at her don't make me angry just do as i said now we hear that you are mary oh yes so where is mrs john let us meet her meet her too Yeah, we want to see your wife too. I entered in living room and started to give them juice from tray. Uh she is not at home guys. When next time maybe I will meet you them. I slip my glass for mistake. It's okay, let me clean it quickly. I knees down and started to collect broken pieces. Chunko was glaring at you with anger. My mom trained all made so perfectly for every work. As I hear that, I quickly looked at his direction. My eyes met his free eyes, which makes me hurt more. He said me mad. He hate me this much. I can't believe it. I walked to kitchen quickly. After a few minutes, 
I walked to the living room and looked at his tailors. Excuse me, sorry for disturbing, but if anyone needs something, then tell us. And Jungkook hope you introduce them to your wife. But Mrs. Chuan Jungkook said us that she is not at home now. She must come yet, Cook. Let us call her for you. I looked at mom in fear. I already introduced her as my maid. Oh gosh. Yeah, come here, dear. Now from kitchen. I can't come now, mom. I have some work to do. She's just like my daughter, learning new things. So let me help her. I will show her soon. Back with her after help her. I walked in kitchen and said her to meet his friends and dealers, but she just didn't agree with me and again started to cry. I shake my head in no. I not want to go. Please, mom. Please, Jungkook's mom. Ah, uh, why you not want to? It's your work. You should meet them. You didn't agree. Forget out. That side, and finally his mom tried to explain you, so she left the kitchen in anger. Sorry, but she had some work, some headache, so she went for rest, and she left for sleep. It's okay. As my mom left, I signed, and soon our home meeting end too. As I stand up again, a plate fell, and I called her. Hey, you. As he called me, I walked to them. Excuse me, her name is Vian. Oh, I'm sorry, I don't know your maid name. Maid what? Jungkook's mom glared at him and looked away. Sorry to say, but you must have some misunderstanding. She's my Jungkook's wife, Mrs. John Vian. But Mr. John called her mad. I was thinking that what to say now. You had misunderstanding cause my son is always lost in his work and business. He lost to eat and forget to sleep through one time. He is so much passionate for his work. And I'm sure that he didn't know that who would bring the snacks here. That's why he said you that. Oh, nice to meet you Mrs. John. Nice to meet you too. You too. I looked at her and introduced her with my friends turn by turn. So they all left from there. As she came in room, I locked the room behind her and pinned her to wall and looked at her in more anger. So you didn't do as I said you. I'm sorry. I looked at him and looked down. Don't look in his eyes. I didn't dare to look at him. Look at me now. And this time... You can't run by your sorry. Be ready for punishment. Punishment, please no. You need a punishment. Then you will never dare to disobey me. I pulled her to me and then started to punishment her harshly. And then so I didn't break it for even rest. As I suddenly did that, tears rolling down from my eyes. I tried to breathe, but he didn't let me go. I tried to push him and breathe and try more from free from his grip, but he didn't let me free from this all. Is this gonna be continue? Thanks for watching and see you all in the next video. Don't forget to subscribe my channel.